Yeah. Hello, my name is Teresita Blanco, the Angel Sister, and today we're doing a Barbie photo shoot. Like some, some props arrived, some new props arrived in the mail, so and I'm still trying to figure out how to integrate them into the photo shoot. So one of them is, uh, they're both from Silver Buffalo. Yeah, they're both... Sanrio products. Yeah. Because Hello Kitty and Sanrio are the ones who made the good Tama and the Hello Kitty stuff. Yeah, the cup noodles is Nissin times X Hello Kitty and this is good Tama, which is like a character from like the Hello Kitty world. Mm-hmm. And it says, please stop. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to get poked by the shops, this but yeah. I'm gonna do what I want. <laughs> pokey pokey. <laughs> so yeah, cup noodles. Are <laughs> yeah. we gonna find cup noodles? <laughs> no. Mm. Actually, you want cup noodles over there? I just don't want to make them. <laughs> Like, uh, my cup noodles are not good. They're just instant stuff. Yeah. Oh my <laughs> crazy opera. They'd be like, okay, so how are they performing my product? I'd be like, okay. <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> Well, they're both redheads. Mm. <laughs> the cup noodle and uh... <laughs> These are first Hello Kitty prop, right? Like... Yeah. I mean, it's small enough to be to serve as a prop for like a dog photo shoot. This is our officially licensed product that was sent to us by the manufacturer to promote it. And you fell. So there's gonna be like a link in the description of this video, and if you buy it there, we'll make a buck. Yeah. Uh, we're oh. not monetized yet, so this is the best we can do for the time being. Yeah. We will be soon, you just gotta keep watching our stuff. Yeah, watch it. And keep subscribing, like, subscribe your grandma, okay? Just don't have her watch Dark Souls, it'll scare her. Yeah. <laughs> well, we don't know if she if like, she's totally into Dark Souls. Oh, yeah. Well, I should be, like, really into Dark Souls. Yeah. The Dark Souls. Yeah, at least just a World War One or something. Yeah. Like, it's reminds me of Trench Warfare. Yeah. <laughs> hey, that's a... No, in, uh, in, like, Trench Warfare, like... Can you imagine if like the souls born people they're like a well, they're, they're like a World War One type of game or something like that? Oh god, a World War One set video game by From Software would be awesome. <laughs> oh, we already have a uh, Armor the, Core. Yeah, which is real, but. Mm. I really want to play in there. So yeah, Silver Buffalo. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, Silver Buffalo. So it says. It. And you can find them at Amazon through the link that we're going to put in the description. Mm-hmm. That's like ceramic, that's not like cheap or whatever. That's, uh... Like if I throw it, it might survive. It might. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you know, they said that if you put something hot next to a whatever product it sells, so you know, <laughs> Barbies are designed to, to, to be supermodels, so there you have it. Mm-hmm. 
So Diego. Yeah, I understood that. Yeah, she's talking. She's talking to Diego. I'm already sorry, so I get that door. French door. That's how French door sings. Oh, Diego. Like what she says, swiping, I'm swiping. <laughs> <laughs> That's when the swiping of swiping folks just up. <laughs> See, say swiping of swiping, swiping of swiping. Oh, man. Yeah, there's a lot of different brands being mentioned here at once. We got Hello Kitty, Barbie, Dora the Explorer, some yeah, other things. Yeah, but thing. Barbie ain't paying me for this. Yeah. Uh, I wish I could get paid for like just playing. I just see, I, I just see they have spon- a sponsorship program. Right? Yeah, it's not the other too big to like need anything. Mm. Yeah. Express her being, we're still waiting. Yeah, this is how we would like promote <laughs> <laughs> your Express VPN stuff. Yeah. Without footage? Yeah. <laughs> and creepy opera. Yeah. <laughs> so dumb. I know. I know. It makes it dumb until you become a millionaire out of it. That's the awesome thing, just being just the artist's sister and no one else. Like, we don't have a studio. Helping us with any of it, it's just winging it and hoping for the best. No, that strategy seems to be worse. Uh, it's like we're gonna reach a hundred thousand subscribers by the end of the month if it skips up. <laughs> I'm making a lot of shams panic because, like, uh, they do weekly programming and we do. Like, we we do published daily. 30 videos yesterday. So. Like wow, and, and not even on purpose. Most of them were like by accident, just awesome thing that happened. Yeah. yeah. It fits just nice. Mm-hmm. It's a good bed for your <laughs> for your dog. Yeah. I'm sure you can eat from it too, but like... Mm. Mm. You know, if we eat spaghetti, we can like eat it there and then like... Yeah, I mean, it's, yeah, we could definitely eat spaghetti there. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I wish I thought it was spaghetti and eat it from there. Yeah. I mean, I like spaghetti. I mean, from the Polo Norte. Yeah, good spaghetti there. I know the Poro Norte, Rey Pizza. Yeah. Which is like the Cuban version of like the best pizza ever. Yeah, if you want, it's like the anti New York style pizza. Yeah. It's fat. It's like the opposite of the New York style pizza. 
It's like somebody saw the New Year's stop and said, I'm going to do the opposite of what they're doing. Yeah. It's basically like a huge bread with a little bit of... Cheese? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, it's a very bad bread. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Time? Yeah, it's 10 minutes, run. yeah. It's still running. Cerdito. It's French for something, who knows? Maybe pig? I guess. Why is he pig? Or maybe he's talking about the food he's eating. Yeah. <laughs> maybe it's Diego, right? Like... Yeah, Diego! Complaining about a pig? <laughs> Oh, and Dora. <laughs> Can you imagine Dora the Explorer, the Afro style? Mm. In a language that you don't understand. Mm -hmm. Spanish? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's most Americans watching Dora the Explorer in its original language. We <laughs> speak Spanish, I would Yeah. We speak Spanish, man. <laughs> <laughs> Fidel? Yeah, I heard Fidel. Like, yeah, is there Fidel Castro now? Well, he would have been alive when this was made, so maybe. Yeah, but since it's like a music from the 40s, Fidel hadn't evolved into a super villain yet. Yeah, so. Like, most people don't know that Fidel Castro started as a, as a lawyer. Yeah. Yeah, like defending, defending like a uh, truth and justice. <laughs> like, yeah, he was Phoenix Wright before he became uh, Edgeworth. <laughs> President Edgeworth? <laughs> uh, like, he was like, nothing stupider than communism until the Russians said that he was good. Yeah. Which is hilarious because even after the Russian left communism, all of that, they still kept following all of their. All of their whatever. Like, they didn't even find out that the Berlin Wall fell until 20 years ago. <laughs> yeah. Because they were too busy following uh, the Phantom of the Soviet Union. Whatever. Let's not talk about that train wreck. FYI, no trains running Cuba. <laughs> <laughs> and giant fishes come out of lakes and eat little pollitos and children. Yeah. <laughs> so, Claudia. Because they had the crazy idea to genetically mutate fishes in order to make them grow forever so they could have infinite fish and then they created a mutant fish. That was poisonous so they that couldn't was, eat it! Yeah, they, they, they forgot to taste the fish before they made a billion of them. No, so, no, not that. It's a, it's a, because of all of the weird genes, it ended up being poisonous. <laughs> So now there's like a plague of poisonous fish uh, running among Cuba. <laughs> there's nothing that they can do about it. <laughs> the moment those things become saltwater tolerant, we're doomed. Like, I wish we were making this up. I really do. <laughs> look, I it up. I look it up, Claudia. <laughs> like, Florida. <laughs> like, if one of those lands in the air, then it's over. They can eat a crocodile. I see how big they get. Game over, man. Game over. <laughs> like at least back when they when they placed like uh, snow cones on the head of cows in order to make them produce uh, better milk, it didn't hurt anyone but the cows. Right? Yeah, they gave it a crazy. Mm -hmm. So yeah, the logic of that one was that they believed that if the head of the cow oh, was yeah, called. Oh yeah, <laughs> <laughs> 